we started as a preschool and half-day kindergarten in 1963, so for 53 years we've been serving students in the preschool age group. Today we offer a part-time and a full-time option for parents. The part-time runs Monday through Friday 9 to 12, and our full day runs from 8.30 to 3 with before and after school options available for working parents. What we do here really is the first steps. A lot of it is very social. A lot of the children are coming to school for the first time. Um, a lot of, of the students don't have that exposure to a lot of children, so it's good for the parents to bring them in early so that they can have that exposure. It integrates children socially, so they get used to like how to play with each other and how to talk to each other. They may not be ready to quite jump into a full day program right away, but this is a slow integration into this is how I get along with other, other people my age, this is how I talk to other people, and this is how I interact with other adults. Um, after they have put their things away, and then they are free to choose a work. And I call it specifically choosing a work because um, it gives them ownership and pride that this is, this is my work right now. This is what I'm, I'm doing. Some, some lessons lend themselves better to group time. Uh, some I always want to do individually. For instance, anything with handwriting, I would do one-on-one. -on -one. The pre-K class has several different enrichment opportunities. Uh, we have a music teacher that comes, and that's Teresa Allred. She'll perform music with them once a week. And then they also participate in our PE program. They have instruction by Ellen Foster three times a week. The North Carolina Zoo has come for their Zoo to You program where they come and share animals and the children get to go up and pet them and learn about them. We're teaching experiences. We're providing experiences. They're not just being given information and asked to repeat it back to us. We want to see that implemented. We want them to use their own problem solving skills and it also makes learning fun. So that's what we want all of our children to have that first little um, introduction to school just be one of fun and love and just the love of learning.